Misfit Philippines. What do you think made you win the competition? Well, for me, naman, diba, every one of us has our own perspective on a queen's win. But for me, I personally want to know, uh, I want to think that the reason why I won is more than because of the standard-based criteria based on the paper sheet of the pageant, but it's more of like my story and how I brought it to the platform that I have during Misfit Philippines. And I mostly like utilize the platform that I have that time. And more than me as a queen, I think the pro media company, the organizers behind it, really see through me as a person. You know, my hard work, my commitment, my passion, and even before that, it was hard for me to really contemplate on that, but now they see it and they continuously see it. You know, some people will say it's destiny, but for you, it's destiny combined with hard work and, of course, perseverance. Grabe, congratulations. Okay, so ito na. Um, when you saw the poster or uh, the ad asking girls to join the competition, what exactly made you want to join Misfit Philippines back in 2021? Well, as most of you, again, know, I'm still green behind ears when it comes to pageantry. I just started joining way back in 2021. But I asked for a sign from God. I only want to join pageants that are truly advocacy driven. And I saw, while I was crawling on Facebook, I saw the sponsored ad of Misfit Philippines. And I consulted with, with, with Dito Raj and he said, just go for it. But more than that, I felt like that pageant was supposed to be for me. So I joined and you know, I, I am a holistic fit person I am because you know, fairly much I see fitness as utilitarian it's more than just the aesthetic and so i did i i joined it and the rest is beautiful history with a crown absolutely and we were part of that history congratulations yeah no, no. again i'm proud so misfit philippines um you've been reigning for over a year now if i'm not mistaken yes. so there are of course going to be challenges in any endeavor so what do you think are the challenges for the misfit philippines 2021 well, based on experience, you know, being Misfit Philippines, I am the image and the figure of holistic fitness. So, you know, the hardest part about that is just being able to present the best and the fittest version of myself every time that I present myself on stage to so everyone that I meet. It's hard to eat well. It's hard to work out. You cannot deny that fact, right? It's hard to be determined. But, you know, the hardest part about that is it's still the most productive and the most fulfilling part. So I want for the queens, for the delegates, right at the back of the stage to realize their true purpose. And even if they're experiencing a lot of hardships right now, you just put the hard work on the hardship, it can truly birth to a lot of possibilities. And that is based on experience. You know, the way Yana answers, you can feel that everything she says is from the heart. You know, alam mo totoo yan, I agree with you, it's so hard to maintain a healthy diet, a lifestyle, you gotta commit to it, but like you said, if you're really doing it for a purpose, then it'll just come out naturally, and mararamdaman mo na mas madali na siya in the long run. It is, yeah, definitely. Ito naman, we know that you've been absorbed by Pro Media. You are now an officer ng Pro Media. Now, since you've been with them, how do you find ang ating new Misfit Philippines 2022 contestants being a Pro Media officer yourself? It is definitely a good experience that I have had with them. They're also sweet, very driven, at the same time they're so fun. They're just all of the best characteristics that I can think of. And all I want to for them to realize is they're already here, so just right. maybe enjoy the moment. And you know, I'm just so excited to see what's yet in store for them. So on the 31st, you guys should be prepared to see our next Misfit Philippines. A big round of applause once again, ladies and gentlemen, for our Misfit Philippines 2021, Yana Marie Aduana. We will be seeing her again. Thank you, Yana, so much. Again, in the grand coronation night of Misfit Philippines 2022, this coming January 31, it's going to be happening by 7 p.m. Great. You're right here at the Palazzo Verde. Marami, marami salamat, Yana.